Hey everybody, Sean Stepinski. It's a little noisy out here. We wanted to show you some voltage readings that you can take on a 189, 288, or a 280 extreme heat pump. We get a lot of questions on where you should measure voltage, where you should tie communication wires. So we're gonna to try to show you live here. So it might be a little bit noisy. We're gonna move over here to the unit. Down below here, we have one of our technicians from one of our Brian contractors, John, helping us out here, taking some measurements for us. The first measurement you always want to take is to make sure your voltage, your high voltage is correct down here. We need to go from L1 to ground, L2 to ground, making sure they're the same. And then we need to go from L1 to L2, and we want to stay between about 187 to 253 AC voltage. The next most important thing is when you're doing communication is here. This is yellow and green or A and B. Do not land your wires here for communication. Communication has to go through this ferrite core. They should be landed here. Those yellow and green wires are here. This is your communication, A and B. This wire here that is tied on from the thermostat goes through this core to eliminate noise attaches to the plug. Do not attach to the plug for communication. As we move up the inverter at the top, this is the output of the inverter in DC voltage. Switch the meter here. 220 volts AC going in usually produces somewhere around 350 volts DC going out. And he's measuring that across the top of the inverter. If you make sure those voltages are right, that really eliminates a lot of problems. High voltage between 187 and 253 between L1 and L2. Make sure you check L1 to ground, L2 to ground. Do not attach your digital A and B wires from the connects onto that green plug. Make sure you attach on the yellow and green so it goes through the core. Your input at 220 volts going in AC usually produces about 350 volts output. Those are pretty solid numbers. Always make sure you have those. Hope you enjoyed that. Hope that was helpful for you.